bleep, 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 bleep. <laughs> As you are technically an ensign, uh, Mr. Thunder, you will have to change the uh, color of your space suit. When you Even finally... This is a training mission. I'll give temp- I'll, as a captain, I'll give temporary dispensation to allow for customized uniforms. Just keep it to the basic colors. Okay, then. I appreciate that. Yeah. Well, Just, the, the, you would have... Uh, when the Admiralty is around, Mr. Thunder, you will have to wear uh, official colors, and as an ensign, that would be yellow. Not gray? I thought... Well, hello, HD. I, and I'll just wear blue. I wear blue because I found this very specific blue that I liked. So... It's like, I don't really want to change it, because it'll be a pain trying to find this blue again. Well, we do have a captain that allowed us, that, that is uh, allowing informal uniforms at the moment, so... The cool story. Ultimately, Captain, I intend to do the same. Um, that being said, I chafe at uh, I chafe under formality, but I have to admit, I sound really good when I when I go full on protocol. You do actually. I remember from how the first mission that we did together. That was like I ha- I I kept thinking. This guy got, like, a list of things to say next to him. <laughs> he sounds really prepared. I've been here for a while, and I have, and I am not prepared for anything. Well, I've been doing, uh, I've been doing role plays, especially, you know, sci-fi and quasi-space-themed role-playing for the better part of 20 years. Actually, closing on 30 years. Damn. Yeah, I just I just, <laughs> I just watch too much Star Trek and stuff, so I tend to know like these little obscure names of certain components. Yeah, that's the one thing I don't have. I don't have a lot of knowledge of Star Trek. I'm more. Oh, I just realized that we kind of kicked Star and HD out of voice chat one. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. The coup Our, is beginning. Uh, well, I mean, let's see how let's see how this all plays out first. Yeah, as I said, I'm thinking. I'm considering it, and really, keep it. There are so many types of ammo in here. How many ammo? mods do you where? have? Where? 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 Uh, the spawn menu. Oh, right. I knew that. I knew that. I'm not. So, still loading. <laughs> just keep loading. Just keep loading. Yeah, Mr. Thunder, <coughs> uh, or really, I should say, Ensign Thunder has unusual. Why is I worse than my haircut? Time for this game, which is weird because I thought it was just. I thought it was the amount of. Uh, I'm running a survival world with the uh, Thunder and three fourths, just not story related at all to this, at least. And three fourths had a problem with that. I assumed it was because of the uh, the amount of grids and just the size of uh, some of the bases there, but apparently it's just the game. With engineers. <laughs> Space engineers for him is Loading Simulator twenty twenty one. Station sick bay. Yes. Question: What do we use for as our standard weapon? Um. Well, it's up to the actual it's up to the actual captain here, but In I had Star intended I, I had intended uh, free I, I had intended free clearance to uh, bring any weapons uh, you saw fit. That being said, since uh, Mister Three Fourths is still a ways out, I may as well go ahead and start with the. Uh, Start with the mission briefing here. 
since Thunder is in, I can. I'm looking right at him. He's purple. Still, uh, yes, I love purple. <laughs> Still no. kind of loading, but yeah. Again, <laughs> we, have, we have special clearance to. Uh, we have special clearance to change the colors of our uniforms, but when the Admiralty is around, we gotta we gotta keep it professional. I'd like everyone to arm themselves with a standard S10. Just basic. Well, I have no objection to that, but I believe we should, at I believe we should prepare to have some potentially heavier weaponry. But this is just our standard. During the day, nothing's gone Nothing's gone wrong yet. And unlike. Uh... Uh, and unlike typical, this is a uh, breaking character slightly. This is a creative mode thing, so everyone should have just free access to uh, get what they want. Hmm. <laughs> ah, yes. The shop. What do you have for me, Vic? For Inferno? Oh, man. I got, I got that one for you, sir. I'm about to get, like, a metal plate or something, or a steel plate or something, aren't I? <laughs> <clears throat> Loading simulator, still going. <laughs> well, at least you're visible and in faster than, uh, usual. Like it so far? Let's see, where's the other thing? Seriously, Ben's... Oh, since the... 90s and early 2000s, since I last watched Star Trek. Oh, I'm not gonna know anything. Oh! <laughs> I, have, I have no oh, idea what that thing... Okay. I have no idea what that thing uses, so I'm just gonna give you some missiles. <laughs> For I may else. have enough weaponry on me to, you know, take combat over a, a shuttle. small country. Just enough to combat a shuttle. <laughs> you know, that's a small country, man. <laughs> now, this is my stuff, so don't touch it. Why is it a good? Why, why did I think it was a good idea for me to be anywhere near weapons again? <laughs> because you like them. Yep, fair enough. That's exactly right. Not as much as uh, not as much as three fourths does. He was he nearly passed down his engineering role for tactical officer. I used to be a tactical officer actually. I doubled. I only transferred over to helm when I was really called for. <laughs> So does the uh, rifle no longer take the NATO magazine? Um, no, the rifles take their own specific, Because uh... I remember it used to take the NATO magazine. No, it doesn't remember. We're in creative mode right now, so it's not as important. Yeah. Come on. Um, <sighs> still waiting. <laughs> Anyone has any solutions to help uh, Thunder here fix his uh, loading simulator problems? I am open to hear them because I have thought of I I, I thought of. Uh, I, I try. I I've tried everything I can think of. And uh, everything's like low setting, except for like, like, the ships, like the the building material is like a medium, and that's it. Like it shouldn't take that this long to load in. Yeah, with graphics, I also like to keep it low, except for model and texture. Yeah, I only have like I think it's modeling. That's only medium. That's it. Everything else is low. Why? <laughs> it's 
Dr. Sten, if you would care to join us. Uh, one moment. I am... There's a few grids around that, uh, might be slowing things down, so... I'm also very quickly correcting we'll Revis oversight. Is everything okay? It will be. What about that mining transport? It was a big oversight. Uh, standby, I'll take care of that. Well, disconnected. Yeah, I'm gonna try a, a disconnect and reconnect. He's back. Kind of, sort of, par partially. <laughs> He's back in spirit. <laughs> I shall haunt you. And we have a minute to three force. Hello there. Hello there. Steam, uh, can you please? Like uh, it's because my first, it's the first and last, it's the first letter of my first and last name. Oh, yeah, you told me that before. I forgot. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I get that question quite a lot, actually. I mean, it's an odd logo considering my, my name's three fourths. <laughs> I love it. The only reason why I have this Lego logo is because I've had it ever since my dad first got me a computer. Fair. If, if Dude, had... Legos are epic! <laughs> Very but fair. I, that, that, that's why whenever I make a count, I still use it. <laughs> it's like... Why, why do you think uh, I love Space Engineers as much as I do? Because when I... I, it was, I played with Legos. I still play with friggin' Legos. I still play with Legos, and I'm like 30. <laughs> yeah, I'm eight years your senior. <laughs> I, literally, I literally bought uh, 20 pounds of Lego. <laughs> and actually, it might have been even more pounds than that. Like, I bought giant bags of Legos, and I have them, you know, right in the other room. I make uh, Lego guns that actually, like, function. Sweet. They don't shoot anything, but they, you know, have a functioning magwell, have a functioning slide, stuff like that. Oh, That's wow. cool. And uh, I also make swords. I'll have to find a picture of my Lego sword that I built. Sweet. Okay, you need to see your sword. Okay. Hi there. Um. Okay, nope. so. Don't worry, we have no idea what's going on either. So, whose ship am I joining, and what's going on? Well, on you're going to be joining the. You're, you're going to be joining the med medical room where it says Station Sick Bay. Okay. Uh, and this is a little, this is a little uh, story world I cooked up with uh, the permission of Star Prime. And initially, it was supposed to be just a a brief little fun mission with uh, for just you and Thunder. Uh, and then Mister Inferno and uh, Mister Leo decided they wanted in, and <laughs> Thunder was okay with it. You were nowhere to be found, so. <laughs> Sure, what the heck. And Thunder is in the process of reconnecting uh, Mr. Oh, hey! Some... Hello there. You're moving. Uh, yeah. <laughs> hey there. And I've turned the kitchen into a gun shop. This... I don't think Starfleet would approve, Mr. Dracona. <laughs> as an official member of Starfleet, as a captain, in fact, I wholeheartedly approve. <laughs> in, in screenshots, I, I put a couple pictures of an old gun I made back that I found. On so pick up the S10, right? Yep. Now, uh... we are going to be. Th this is going to be kind of a uh, a role play heavy mission, and as soon as Mister Three Fourths joins us, uh, I'll begin the I'll begin the briefing. Who's going to be our CO? Well, I believe the CO would fall to the captain's role, which is Mr. Inferno, as I understand it. What, sir, the... are you joining? 
Uh, just uh, right click on um, it uh, sends okay, name and then join game. I'll take you right there. Perfect. But the DM will still be uh, sent. For yeah. For the most part, yes. I mean, I shouldn't have to do too. I, I shouldn't have to do too much GMing. Um. And like Thunder got a little bit of a. Uh, uh, not that he got a behind the scenes look at what I was building here, but he got a behind the scenes look of how friggin' hard it is to make a uh, <laughs> to write a story. Yeah. Because I told, like, he contacted me at 6.30, which is when I wanted to get this started. Yep. And I'm like, okay, it'll take a few more minutes. And then something came up, and then it took a few more minutes. And then next thing we know, it's 7.30. And now it's 8.30. <laughs> yep. And... <laughs> this is me. what I put up with as a dungeon master every week. <laughs> Jeez. Well, I guess that means you're on the eastern shore? That is yes, of... east coast. Yeah, because uh, for me it's seven twenty-three. I'm in Texas. Ooh, nice. Right. Yeah. Seven twenty-three. <coughs> Excuse me. You okay? Yeah. Okay. We don't have a medical officer on this mission, therefore <laughs> uh, I order you not to die. <laughs> <laughs> You are ordered to you are ordered to avoid death at all costs. I am. Um, if it helps, I went through all training courses on Star Fleet, so I'm technically a jack of all. I'm a, I'm a jack of all trades. Okay. I do have medical training. I'm I'm a I'm a I'm a licensed field medic. Okay. Hey, did... Of course, you have permission. You have permission to become severely injured. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Hey, hey, but but Inferno, <laughs> I, I, I I'm just I'm just uh, I'm just uh, here. I'm not supposed to get severely injured. Inferno, but have you, you walked into a shower walk and come out figured, knowing how to convert hex into RGB? Julio, come outside with me for a moment. Because <laughs> if you look at the uh, Mr. Leo. dark speed chat, oh, that's basically what happened. You'll join me for a moment. Um, he is a captain. Leah. <laughs> By the way, we can't get injured because it's creative. I know. It is. It's satisfying. This is why you should never join my crew. That is basic discipline. It doesn't really work on me. No, but once again, rest relieving. It it does that very well. <laughs> no what? Um, yeah, I would recommend it. Changing into a tactical uniform, the assault uniform, just for. If I had a red skin, I'd use it. But I am not changing this blue. <laughs> That's not what I mean. I mean the suit. I don't really have any heavy armor suits. I just got base game, so I don't know. <laughs> but you get suits by playing survival and looking in random signals. Oh my gosh, I found it. Uh, well, the, <laughs> I don't know on, but enough of the, the game to play survival on my own. I... Oh, you're in. I, I'm in? 
I was just preoccupied in trying to find a picture, an old, old picture of my Lego katana. <laughs> what sick bay do I land on? Uh, you're gonna go for the one that's a station stick bay. Okay. Well, that's and, cool. Uh, in screenshots, I posted the gun and my Lego sword. Sweet. Right. Also, face reveal. Yeah, I, I don't know if that's a face reveal. I'm, I'm like, what? I might be like 14 or 15 now. 16 or 17 in that picture. <laughs> so half of your age? Uh, <laughs> that's only about five years ago. <laughs> I thought you said you were 30 something. That, that's that's Sen. I'm only 22. Oh, Thunder is the one who was 30. I am 30. I really? You don't have sure my face posted somewhere. I know, and I don't look it either. <laughs> Especially like, when shaven. Like, like, Sen sounds his age. I sound older. Thunder sounds younger. I sound like a kid. <laughs> <laughs> or I sound I'm gonna go. I've been told I don't act my age. Which I All right. <laughs> what, what of you broke this table? Uh, As that you... would have been me. <laughs> <sighs> there is... There, there, I may have gotten a little bit, uh, hasty <laughs> in just, you know, slapping crap down to get this ready. And again, <laughs> I, was here. I wanted to launch... I wanted to launch this two hours ago. Yeah. <laughs> Dog on my hand, so excuse me if something weird happens. <laughs> I like, but I like the irony. Me currently standing on the table. Who broke the table? <laughs> <laughs> this is actually a really cool interior, though. Okay, who shot Leo? I think you did. <laughs> what was that? I think you did. <laughs> Sorry, uh, did, did, did you say something? <laughs> uh, thunder, thunder, you might want to stop now. <laughs> no, no, Thunder, please tell me, uh, did you say something? <laughs> no! <laughs> you know, I found a way to rapid fire these things. <laughs> okay. So, so oh, the extension of my suits is metallic, badger, cow, leopard, and rainbow. Yeah, let's stick with metallic. Um, three fourths. I will point out that uh, as the uh, as the highest ranking officer here, uh, Mister Inferno has given us special dispensation to wear whatever color uniforms we wish. That being said, when we're in the presence of uh, proper admiralty and have to observe necessary protocols. You will have to wear a... Actually, you will have to... As engineer, you will have to wear a blue uniform, as I understand it. Okay. Why is this gold statue moving? Let's see. <laughs> That's three-fourths. Also, yeah. someone knocked the gun <laughs> the floor. You're fine. Yeah. We don't have... We're not in the presence of admiralty, so by all means... Wear what you, uh, according to Mr. Inferno here, wear what you wish. How do you get the tactical? I think it came with the Warfare uh, DLC. Oh, yeah. Ha. Ah, I don't have any. Many... I have. I'll pick it up. <laughs> they won't let me pick it up. Oh, never mind. <laughs> you already picked it up. Yeah. Alright, since everyone is here. I mean, technically, I'm okay, wearing when blue. When does fall out? <laughs> <laughs> One DLC that I tend to do my best to forget. Just put random stuff together. <laughs> so everyone's here that should be here. Oh, I like that blue and gold, correct. man. Blue and gold. I love you already. <laughs> blue and gold were my the colors of my high school sports team. Uh. Blue and maize were uh, mine, but like a like a deep royal blue and gold would be my favorite co colors. <laughs> I still wouldn't wear it in the presence of the admiralty, but what is that? I think that's the ghillie suit. <laughs> it is. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it looks like somebody looks like somebody wrapped you in. Emotions. 
It looked like somebody wrapped you in blue duct tape. <laughs> Sorry, I was stuck in the air vents. <laughs> 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 anyway, we can get started. I'm just being just an idiot. Starfleet cannon. Big Force is always in an air vent somewhere. <laughs> that's what, that's what he's doing. He's I not, see. Like, not actually off my head. I'm in an air vent, waiting to do some form of like horror movie jump. One of the, one of one of these days, y'all are just gonna be like chilling, walking around, and I'm just gonna climb up the vent, and they're like, "That's not sus." <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, if we're all ready, we can begin the uh, the briefing here. So, you should be engineering. Just hang out in the Jeffrey's tubes. <laughs> Actually, he is engineering. I am. I'm chief engineer. <laughs> so, to make this uh, to make this short and sweet, this is just a pretty simple scout and recon mission. Uh, we have. Uh, two Type 11 shuttles ready for launch. We'll be docking up with a uh, small, uh, small un, uh, uh, unlicensed cargo ship to uh, make the warp jumps. Uh, just doing uh, some brief recon of the system because there's been some unsubstantiated reports of heavy space pirate activity and the Admiralty wants a uh, wants a, wants us to poke around. So don't be uh, don't be too worried but I'd pack a few extra I'd pack a few extra weapons just in case and with all that I'd say the uh, this briefing is over and we're ready to begin. So, Inferno, the weapons I gave you in, is my head cannon of you. It's like you're always prepared to take down a shuttle. <laughs> this is my sidearm. <laughs> so, how do weapons work in the robot? Do we have, like, a specific you have metal? very, very deep pocket. Okay. Thank you. Uh, it's, it's that, like, quantum subspace folds, that kind of stuff. It's like a pocket like this... dimension. Yeah. We we just carry around subspace full generators. <laughs> okay, gentlemen, if does anyone object to being referred to as such? So, do we actually need to carry ammo? Uh, this is creative mode, so the short answer is no. However, in several, when we actually do something on the uh, server, when it, the new server when it's up and uh, up and running, we probably will. Okay. That'll all be fundamentally supplied for us. Now we are going to have to dock with that. Uh, uh, we are going to have to dock these run up uh, these shuttles with this uh, cargo vessel because GM pulled a stupid and didn't add small ship jump drives. Will do. So. Oh. Hello. 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 What's up? Mute. The sky. Yeah, that's old. And actually, I'm up above you. Okay. Because I'm on the upper level. Yeah. Yes. And. Talking. Okay. Uh -huh. Um, did you bring in the garbage? Yes. Thunder. Did you check the mail? Mute. Ah, uh, no. Would you be willing to do that for you? Okay. Very much. Yep. You'll have to come up. Yeah, I know.
tried to use a connector on this. Game. Okay, sorry about that. Chi. I don't want to. Okay. <laughs> Ice box. All right, both ships are docked. Because, right. uh, for those of you who don't know, uh, we were trying to collect ice for the station because it ran out of oxygen again. So I made this large cargo container that I officially named Icebox. And oh. you know, as a rule in SC, you never name anything, or else it's gonna die. <laughs> but uh, once we had finished loading the cargo container, we tried to move it. But then Clang said hi. Oh no! So, I am saying I am here to ruin your day. Uh -uh. I don't know how to use that. <laughs> uh, well, I, put, I sent. Uh, I, I put coordinates in the. Um. Uh, Leo, Leo, get, get in the closet. Why? There's no seats in the closet. I know. I have no idea how to work that elevator. You just fly. Yeah, it's just a. There's not. A, it's not an elevator. It's just a corridor. Oh. Let's use your jetpack. Why? Are there mines on the back of the ship? Uh, because DM or GM was in a rush to. Uh, GM was in a rush, and this was the only blueprint I had, and I experimented with the... This was a very old blueprint that I decided to try and blow up in a flashy manner. I'm deleting them now. There are no mines. In I, I'm standing right next to a whole bunch of warheads. Yeah, delete them. Just delete them. They're, this is creative mode. Destroy them. We must uh, destroy the evidence. <laughs> Whoa, what? Where did some chats come from? Don't ask the question. You don't want to know the answer. Hi there. Excuse me. Hello. GM. This is this blueprint is so old it predates jump drives. So this is a ship that doesn't have them. So I had to put them on last minute because again, GM. GM rolled a natural one on a few things. How many seats does this thing have? I'm sure your past partners can't agree with that statement. Oh, there's plenty of seats on here. Okay. Oh yeah, there's plenty of seats for all of us. No, that's not what I was talking about. So... Okay, I can place... I did paste the, uh, the coordinates for the GPS jump. Who will be our pilot for the day? Uh, I believe that should fall to the new ensign, Mr. Thunder. How Yee. has nobody noticed this yet? <laughs> what? Notice it's what? Kinda, it's oh. kind of big. <laughs> so, Thunder, if you would sit at that control station. No, why did you spawn this in? Because it's Star Trekky. What do you do? Uh, I don't have clearance to use that. Uh, yeah, Leo, Leo, just get get rid of it. Uh, <laughs> we have uh, a ship. We will use this ship. E. Oh, we probably could use my civvy cruiser if you wanted to. <laughs> let's let's just stick with what we got. Yep. I am. Um, oh, I am. Um, oh, yeah. Got about that. I also didn't have. I also don't have a blueprint of it. Fair. Anyway, everyone, you need to just let me know. There are warheads on the outside of this craft. <laughs> Again, <laughs> just, just delete them. Thunder, don't jump yet. Engineering, we'll take care of that. Yeah, I haven't even done a jump yet, so you're gonna have to teach me a little bit. Okay. And where am I going? So, if you press Enter. You'll see a uh, a bit of coordinates that's uh, labeled GPS pirate sighting. Yep. So now you can press the K button, or well, the uh, press K, go to G uh, and go to GPS all the way on the right. 
The thing yeah. about GPS is when someone puts a GPS in chat, the moment they post it in chat, it will show up in your GPS. However, you have a minute to toggle the show on HUD before it disappears. Yeah, it's empty right now. So the moment you post a GPS, anybody interested has to get it. Okay, I can repost it. That's easy. Right, I am. Uh, I am seated. You guys might not see me, but I am seated. Weird. I'm, I'm sure. not seeing. Not seeing it. Okay. <laughs> it's, it's like empty. There we go. Now we, I see it. Okay. And Mr. Three Fourths, I'm pretty sure seat outside the hall is. No, it's inside. About a dozen Starfleet star star no. regulations. No, no, you might not see me, but I'm not outside the hall. I'm inside of the craft. I am inside of inside of the craft. I might have found an air vent. Um, the shuttles are currently fighting the ship. We need to turn the thrusters off. And oh, yep. All right. Uh, Maybe 30 seconds. Fully stopped, so you guys can do that. Why do these doors keep opening on me? Why do you do this? Sensors. I know. <laughs> This is a few. This is guys. Space. We Everything do have an automated. SPRT behind us. A rust oh. freighter, three kilometers out. It is going away though. All right, ship stabilizers have been disabled. I am getting back in my air vent. Well, you do realize if you do groups when something's connected, there's a chance that you might affect the main grid as well. I don't think stabilizers does that to the main grid. What stabilizers? Or dampeners. We press Z. Alright. So now, Ensign Thunder, you will go to, uh, if you go to the control panel and do a search for jump drives, there's two of them. Quick drive, any drive. Uh, it's okay. Wait, isn't, it, isn't it the chief engineer's job to get the jump drive set up? I suppose that would. I, I suppose that is. I, I think it's the chief. It's the chief engineer's job to maintain the jump drives. Okay. Technicalities. <laughs> I mean. Technicalities, my dear Watson. I'm also teach. We're also teaching. Uh, Ensign Thunder how to fly his first large grid ship. Fair. Yeah, I never uh, use jump drive, so. All right. We gotta wait for him to charge first, and they should be almost ready to do that. Jump drives will be ready in 15 seconds. Yep. Jump drives are 15 seconds still full. Excellent. How far do you want me to jump? I'm gonna show you. Uh, you can actually jump directly to those coordinates. Okay. Uh, so you gotta. Uh, they are full. At the. In the middle of the. Uh, you click a jump drive at the. Okay. The yep. There's uh, GPS locations, pirate sighting. You see, you click select. Uh, you click that. You click select, and you'll jump right to those coordinates within about two clicks. Uh, I gotta remove, but the select is great. Oh, okay. Uh, GPS. Okay, there we go. Selected in the wrong one. Yeah, the space engineers go. puts the interaction buttons before the lists, which this is, is... annoying. Yep. All right. Yeah. All right. Jump drives like... are set to pirate sighting. You should be good to go. It's like, whose idea was that, and why have they never fixed it? <laughs> whose idea was it, Keen Software House? Why haven't they fixed it? Because reason. Keen Software House. Jump drives are ready and fully charged. You are clear for jumping. All right. Well, hey. uh, Captain, may I uh, may I give the order? Take it away. 
And some thunder, take us out. Alright, um... How do I do this? Because it's oh. that. <laughs> so, uh, you press G. You find, and... You find the jump drive. So you press G, you find the jump drive, you put it on the toolbar, and then when it gives you a list of options, you select jump. And then you press... <laughs> Yeah, yeah, he didn't tell me that. <laughs> that was just my did. fault, and I apologize. Uh, uh there, what there the? is a Toggle. scenario that teaches you how to use jump drive. Yeah, well, I never did. <laughs> I just play with these guys. <laughs> uh, toggle block on and off, right? Or uh, uh no, you jump. It's, there should be an option. Okay, to jump. J yeah, just jump. Okay. And then you just hit that key on your keyboard. Now is there everybody is everybody seated? Yes. Kinda yes. A little bit late. A little bit late now, but. <laughs> we're, we're, we're find out now. Okay, has anybody been left behind? Good sign. <laughs> Nobody's screaming bloody murder. Seven hundred kilometers away. That's 100 meters. Wait, no, that is kilometers. I guess we didn't have enough charge. No, it said we had a full charge. We or full maybe charge. we didn't have the we didn't have uh, enough power to make the make the full jump. Oh, jump again? Or you have to wait. For not, the charge. We have to wait for them to charge. Yep. May as well just uh, start taking us. Start taking us forward, Ensign, until the jump drives are charged. It's not letting me yep. go forward for some reason. There, there you go. Now we're going. Take us in. Full impulse. I think I have control of the craft? Hold up. That's never a good sign. I need everybody to get out yeah. of the seat. And yeah. Then and then Hold set your, your seat to make cockpit. No wonder it wasn't letting me. <laughs> Do yeah. Did I, I have no control now. Should have, no you sitting. should have control. I have no idea what's in that stage, so I'm gonna have to get back to that. There we go, we're going. Uh, in the control window, like, just press K, and does your seat say main cockpit? Uh. What is the name where of the seat? Uh, with the, there's a bunch of, there's like a little checklist. Control stations. Uh, I it is, don't. It is not set to main seat now. I've set his seat to main seat. Okay. Also, I've put a whole bunch of large reactors on here to speed up the recharge. Excellent. And again, GM apologizes for these, uh, these unforeseen error they didn't have as much prep time as I want I, I would have liked Some of the uh, batteries, it's totally fine. I even tried to stay away for a little bit longer to give you more time <laughs> so it didn't help that I was also you know talking with thunder prepping this and typing with star prime so delays 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 we're slowing yeah. down If you press Z, the ship will drift. Oh, where are we slowing down? Probably because we're not drifting. Yeah, turn off the dampeners. Yeah, uh, they are off. Oh, the shuttles. Yeah, well, they're off too. They might just be clang causing a little bit of problem. I've seen no, clang. The, the shuttles were thrusting. That's what I was... That's weird. I turned the them off. Like I said, 
with connectors, sometimes the feature spreads to all the connected ships. That's why I would just, what I would do with the shuttle is I would set it over the connector, turn off the thrusters, then connect it. Yeah. I usually have a group of all my thrusters on a ship so I can turn them off easily. Well, the, like I said, even with a group, if you just turn off the group, if you have the same name group in other connected ships... Well, I name, I name it like... If I have like thirty X wing, each X wing has a has its number next to the group. Okay. I've had that problem in the past and had to deal with it. You've had a problem where you had thirty X wings. Not X wings, but I had four of my typhoons. The fun fact. The fastest a jump drive can be charged is about seven or eight minutes. Ah, uh, I've never done jump drive, so. Yeah, yep. he's only had. This is his first time flying a, a large grid vessel. If I'm just letting you know, like, no matter how much power you have, the fastest a vanilla jump drive will charge is about seven to eight minutes. Yep, I don't use vanilla jump drives a lot. I don't use not vanilla drives a lot. I mod the heck out of this game. Well, engineering, what is our time to uh, what is our time to jump? Yeah, it'd be nice to know when I can uh, jump. What are you again. doing in my quarters, Mister Inferno? <laughs> uh, two minutes. <laughs> Inferno just looked back, sees me in my chair, walks away, hops into the vent, leaves. <laughs> I can see, I can see your tag. See anything? Nothing happened. Everything fine. There's a lot of blood in my head right now. I'm I'm not seeing that clearly. Sunshine, lollipops, and roses. I thought it was rainbows. <laughs> yeah. I don't know the song. Sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows, everything. When we're together. Something like Cloud of the Chance Ball or something like that. Over here. Spider what? Spider Force over here. What about the spider? I just have a seatbelt on. You're ruining the joke. That is unacceptable. I'm sorry. Termination. Open the bot doors. For summary, the jury quest has been terminated. Please leave the vicinity immediately before self-destruction. You know that little bigger jump jump start cars so now I need to get inside. Yeah, right. oh, what was that? Right. <laughs> what? What are you saying? I, I I don't know why you're hanging from the ceiling like that, man. That's just creepy. <laughs> but not at the center of your helmet, the big one. It's a great target. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Look at your visor. Uh. Oh, oh, yeah. That is a nice target. It's like a little mini Death Star laser. Now, don't stay perfectly still. <laughs> The jump drives are charged. Roger that. Oh, <laughs> back in my seat. Yes. I've closed all the doors. Doors closed. Everybody in seats. Hold. Everybody in seat. Dealing some something. We all good? Clear. Jumping. Barrel head first into a hostile situation. Oh, that's totally barrel head first in a hostile situation. What could possibly yeah. go wrong? We are we're passing virus sightings. Uh, press Z to activate inertial damage. Stop, no, Why are you accelerating? Stop. Stop. 
Stop. Oh, stop. stop. We'll stop. I have no visual. Now we need to turn around. And with Space Engineers, turning is easier if you thrust in a direction. It's going to take a while. Yeah, okay. this is a Edward. unmarked cargo ship. This is slow, isn't it? It's sluggish. Very sluggish. Maybe check something. How's that? That's better. I'm gonna give you some more power. This thing is terrible with power. For some reason, the gyroscopes are all purples down to 50. What? Uh... Now have more power and more gyros. Uh, SPRT, private sale, seven clicks out, nine o'clock. That's just vanilla. It's probably not scenario. I'm assuming that would be correct. We are supposed to document pirate sightings, and I've seen a few. I'm not meaning to shoot. Please stop. Yeah. Even at the starbase, there's quite a few pirates. Two. We're two kilometers from pirate sighting. Are you getting in? Bring us into 500 meters. Will do. But it sails now six clicks out. I'm just floating with the ship. I really would do so much better at tactical. <laughs> you can always talk to the Admiralty for a transfer. Probably have to do that once you get your ship built. Oh, when you get my ship built, you're going to be my first officer. Oh, dang. Sick. <laughs> Mr. Leo. Yeah. Ship. We don't know if I need to do some other patch jobs. That's my job. Been to your job. There's nothing to be done. <laughs> Bo boost the I'm systems. Sure. That's what I was doing. He We're about 504.3 meters out. We are four right. point click. Right. Take the shuttles and uh, stick the shuttles and do a little bit of recon. But he needed more. more. He needed more generals and he definitely needed more power. Yeah. Very slow turn rate. Uh, pretty much everything maxed out the power. <laughs> so who's running with me? Fred off? Okay. I am turning on the thrusters for all the shuttles. 10 4. Man, I wish I had my uh, space scooter. I am so glad that you don't. Actually, run out some little ship for stuff like this. Oh, gee. Yep. Go ahead and board the vessel, Thunder. E. All aboard. Get, come in. All aboard. Come in. You're kind of upside down. Oh, jeez. <laughs> here, let me. Oh, dear. Flip us over here. You're still in the gravity well. There you go. There we go. <laughs> still not used to that yet. Go ahead and take a seat. Perfect. Yeah, right next to you, buddy. Let's approach at one quarter impulse. Then four. Vessel. Uh, just take a look around. There is a SPRT private sail right above us. 
about four clicks out. To the rear and below. Basically, it's a bunch of basically it's a bunch of rich people floating around. Yeah. Take control of the vessel, Thunder. I am stepping out. Okay. There are rich people with their unauthorized uh, transponder codes. Okay, gentlemen. I see a couple plants in the distance, but I don't see much nearby. Well, there's yeah, one the supposed to be. One coming in. Pardon? I one coming in. Oh. Well, seeing as there's several ships on sensors, they seem to be almost grouping up around here, to be honest. Like I said, most of them are private sales. It's just rich people with invalid transponder codes. I will not engage unless you guys say so. I don't think I, we have weapons. We have no weapons. No weapons right now? Okay. That doesn't mean we can't refit the shuttle. Uh, Engineer does have the ability to refit small arms. Well, I... Question. I would like you to apply several ph phaser rays to the shuttle. Yeah, by all means. Just light weaponry. We don't have much power. I'm and pretty four. sure the phaser take a lot of power, though. I know, that's what I'm saying. We just want one or two. And four. Keep your ship steady. Yep. Can do. It's a Star Trek mod? Uh, yes. Sadly, Star Trek mods do not fit on small ships. Um, they can't equip us with some Gatlings, however. There are, uh... You can try the, um, phase cannons. That's the phase cannon pulse or beam? Phase cannon pull. Because they don't allow me to place these ships. Oh. Not available uh... for small ship. Face cannon pulse, small grid, small block, I, it's working for me. Wait, am I missing something? What one are you grabbing? Uh, there's the Mark II phase array, which is like Oh, five the five Mark ones three. don't have. Okay. Has to be the Mark III, it looks like. What the heck was that? That was me placing down some weapons. That. <laughs> yep. Just getting something down. Oh, these phasers are tiny. Keep teleporting, what the heck? They're lagging. Hey, uh, gentlemen? Yes? I believe something just appeared, uh, just past the sensor shadow of, uh, that planet over there. I see it. Save our souls! Thirty-four kilometers away. Well, someone give me a read on what that is. Uh, warp core for the USS Odyssey Registry NCC six five four three one. Good to go with the the weapons. Uh, three. Ten four. I'm rigging them up now. I, I'm, I made a phasers grid. Oh, so did I. <laughs> <laughs> it is in slot number two. Uh, toggle clip to fire is on. Uh, test firing apparently. Yes. Leo and I are gonna go take a, take a look ahead. Then four. Uh, I feel like that's an extraordinarily bad idea. All shuttles, please report to the cargo vessel. Can do. Yeah, I was about to say it's kind of far away. Eh, 34 kilometers. It's one jump or 30 minutes. I don't know which one you want to do.
You'll have to let me know where to go, three. If you'd like me to take control for landing, just let me know. Uh, there is a lander at the bottom. You have to pull up that Down here? And four. Said, I'd recommend turning off the first breach of the port section. Yep. I will line you up. Go ahead and flip upside down. Oop. Okay. Or would you like me to take control? That is up to you. I suggest uh, Ensign Thunder retain control. We are trying to improve. We we, we are trying to uh, get him into uh, get him out of flight school. Perform <laughs> that. He's a fine pilot for small grids. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I get him. We got to get him large. We got to get him large vessel training, especially if he's going to fly the. Uh, especially if he's going to fly the project I'm working on. Yep, go ahead and line up underneath here, Thunder. Done. Why is it flipping back? Because it can't flip. It must flip. It wants <laughs> to flip. Just making sure. Okay. I am going to recommend outfitting the cargo ship with some medic weaponry. Alright, you're pretty lined up. Go ahead and lower. Slow her down. Stop and then go forward. I Keep recommend coming. It with that super laser. Keep coming. Oh, Keep that's always coming. Plus, but... Yeah, I probably wouldn't put phasers on this thing because this thing barely powers what's currently on it. For a little bit more. Tiny bit more forward. All right. We're pretty good lined up. Go ahead and go down. All right, stop. Back up just a tiny bit. All right, go ahead and shut off. Go ahead and shut off your engines before docking. Keep. Why? And then press B. You are good to go. There we go. Nice. Up. Exemplary, uh, exemplary teamwork, gentlemen. Uh, do I have to turn? Uh, how do I get out? See, I would. Just uh, toggle the dampers off with the Z key. We tried. It didn't like work I said, for some reason. doesn't work. And he just gotta, he's just gotta get out. So hop out and then, oh, uh, get back in the seat and turn back on and undock. All right, here. Let me see what I can do by shutting it off. Because if you go to the pilot seat on the first. Uh, okay, there we go. The Everything's good. Alright, we're good. Yep. I shut uh we shut off the thrusters uh he already got on that. We are docked, thrusters are shut off. If you'll give me a moment, gentlemen, I will be giving us the means to survive. Despite them acting like they're still on, the thing says they're off. Yeah. Captain, I recommend you hurry. That is a uh, Starfleet Mayday signal. We don't want to keep them waiting too much longer. I can find the doors again. <laughs> well, there's one and there's a top shuttle. There's also uh, an open... There's also a hangar bay at the... Oh, the where the jump drives are. The ha there's a... Uh, what was a hangar bay? bay? Open the vacuum uh, at the front. Can't close the doors. Otherwise, again, your, uh, your GM apologizes for. Whoa! The... Oh, whoa. Who's firing? Me, yeah, I was testing it out the weaponry, seeing what we have. A little too much. 
little warning before you do that next time. Yeah. I'm I just gonna go through here. <laughs> I'd say we're, as for what we have, I'd say a little too much. Do we really need four on the front? Yes. That's two's fine. These are kinetic weapons. They're not quite as powerful as we are used to. Uh, you'd be surprised weapons. how good those flax are. Yeah, a Gatling gun is kinetic weapon. That's not very powerful, so... The Eric's Aaron Weapon Enterprises, it might be kinetic. They shred. They are great for lightly armored ships. Remove two of the flat cannons from the front. SPRT business shipment eh, right next to us, 3.8. They're good for tearing up light craft, but they're not going to be too much for any large craft. Okay. I'm not well. super worried about anything that... Uh passes as a business shipment. And then there's a mining transport as well, too. Oh, this is just... Uh, uh... Bad civilian traffic. It could also be a... It could also be a... Uh, uh, a, a glitch in our sensors uh, registering them as uh, spurt. Yeah, let's get up. Everyone, take a seat, please. Yeah, get in the ship and let's get over to that distress signal. Uh, we're stressed. Is that a GPS or a beacon? It is a beacon. That's a oh, beacon. I, th I think you can jump to beacons, but not antennas. I don't know if it's a beacon or not. I would just point us in the direction and do a blind yeah, point jump. Point us in the direction and do a blind jump. Do five kilometer, do multiple five kilometer blind jumps. It'll. I will prepare the jump. Or How many? While you do that, you might want to walk thunder through it. Somebody else has to walk through it because I am not good at explaining things. My brain does not know how to put words in my mouth. Oh, well, I'm not very good at it either. <laughs> it's... But uh, it's simple as when you go to the jump drives, uh, when you go to the jump group, I guess, go to the bottom, remove pirate sighting from the destination coordinates, and set it to blind jump, and then you can turn down the distance. Um, so that you're able to jump in small increments. Uh, I have it set for a 22 kilometer jump. We are, it should be clear. So remove remove the pirate. It's a, he's already done it. He's just oh, okay. How to do it. Yeah. Yep. Uh, just go ahead that. and. Are they good to go? Are we? Uh... We should be good as long as everybody's trapped in. Okie doke. All right. Uh, once again, Captain, would you like the honors or should I? Done. Very well, Ensign Thunder. Engage. Oh, we are. Champ. Uh. We're in a natural gravity field. Oh, it's. It cuts through the tunnel. It's. We're not in it, but it does cut through it. So, you're gonna have to. I'm gonna turn down that jump. You're gonna have to shorten the jump distance, and you're gonna have to hit it. Uh, angle the ship of angle the ship to port and do a few smaller micro jumps. Yep. Aiming a little bit towards the sun there should get out of the gravity well. That's well, we're well on our way. Because we have inertial dampeners off and we're already at max speed, we don't need to rust. So, want me to do the 13 kilometer jump then? Uh, I would say I would reduce the jump distance to approximately 10. Jump us a little bit. Aim the ship a little bit to starboard first, and then uh, aim away from the planet. Just yeah. say aim away from the planet. Well. <laughs> ah. I guess the starboard is towards the planet. 
at the risk of sounding like a jerk, he's got to learn. He's got to learn port from starboard, and he he does. He knows. But considering the starboard is towards the planet, though. See. <laughs> yeah. Like even like even if we are an act, even an actual role play, we'd probably still say just say aim away from the planet. <laughs> Still won't let me. Come on. We're 13 kilometers away. Might as well just fly, fly to it. Like I said, we're already at max speed, so we don't push forward. Yeah. No, unless you're trading us out. You don't How far out do you want me to stop? Two kilometers. Thunder. Yep. You're wasting power. I am? Yeah, just, uh, we have dampeners off, so you can just coast. Yep, see how we're not slowing down? Yeah. So basically, you only want to put... Wait, if you, have da if you have dampeners off, which means that little triangle in the bottom left is red, if you have dampeners off, the only time you want to push forward is if you're, like, trying to straighten out. It looks like a ship might be moving. Okay, we are in gravity, so you might want to slow down. Might want to uh, press Z. And yep, because the gravity well will slow us down. It will pull us towards the planet. We don't want that. Yeah. Uh, that the ship is four clicks and counting. But pilot, just piloting in general is a lot of ifs thens. <laughs> Three point five clicks. Two hours ten seconds for full stop. Whoa. Ooh. Uh, we have ships in view. A very large ship in view. Not in my view. Not in my is... view. It everything disappeared. Froze. It's a warp core odyssey. Very large vessel. Uh. uh... Okay, not only do I still not see anything, the antenna just disappeared. It's dead ahead. It's two clicks out, dead ahead. Okay, there we go. Now it's loading. Let's bring let's bring the cargo vessel in. That's not the resolute, that's the Odyssey. It's a sister. It's a sister that's been I mean, my history Some. could be wrong, but I think it's been missing for about 10 years. That's correct. That is correct. I think Odyssey brings memories to me. I remember watching Odyssey, and it's been so long. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Let's bring us out. Let's bring us out. I think we can risk getting a little bit closer. Yes, definitely. Far. Close to uh, Ensign, bring us into with uh, Ensign, bring us one kilometer away. It does look like it has a shield generator. So be careful of that. Uh, shield generator may be offline, though it's hard to tell this distance even with zoom. Is there anything on? Nothing just that I'm aware of, no. just the ship. My oars are not sensing. It is confirmed a shield emitter. It doesn't look like it has much weapon, much in the way of weaponry. Uh, shield emitter, shield emitter is online. Be careful. Want me to stop right here? Yeah, let's get in the shuttles. We need to take a look. We need to take this. This is. 
everyone to the shuttles. So this is like the commander's office, the commanding officer's shuttle or something. Oh, then I'll get I'm, I'll get with the the others then. Uh, I was just joking because. Oh, I wanted to keep it. I, I wanted to keep it relative. I had it. <laughs> Sorry, I flipped it over to fit with the gravity well. <laughs> it, it, come on, there we go. She How is she floating in gravity though? ships could handle low gravity. Well, I meant, does that mean she's powered? I'm wondering. Possible, yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm not actually, she might even be in the gravity well. Because we're... Considering I, that he was even that he powered, yeah, he's still under his bunk. Yeah, it is point zero seven. To, and, and once again, also considering the fact that we have the scenery, so... Uh, Inferno, you we got really quiet. We have to prepare for the worst. Um, let's uh, let's not jump to any conclusions just yet. Whenever anybody's standing in this ship, I can't control it, so you're gonna have to take a seat, son. All right. <laughs> um, Gyros just don't work. <laughs> Oh, wow, that's weird. Um, I'm gonna get a bit closer. Three fours open a hailing open a hailing frequency. What? Open a hailing frequency, he said. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what the heck does that mean? <laughs> them, Pretend you're talking to the ship. Uh, hello, Mr. Ship. How are you doing today? <laughs> it's, been, it's been a really long time. <laughs> Did you handle the crap ship burn, I guess? Handle, I'll, handle, I'll handle it. Uh, okay. Odyssey, the fish shuttle crap burn, Starfleet. Did anyone copy? Does anybody copy? <laughs> USS Odyssey. Please respond. She's got some damage on her starboard thruster. Uh, starboard inverse. Captain Inferno. I am currently aboard the shuttlecraft Copernican. Did anybody hear me? It looks like their shuttlecraft is still attached. That's not a shuttlecraft, that's the captain's yacht. That's almost worth. Bring it closer. Odyssey, please respond. That said, her starboard impulse seems to have some damage. I see there's a large chunk out of the uh, right hand side oh, of the ship. Oh, yeah. Uh, permission to... S starboard side, big hole. Yep. Permission to enter the ship. What's in? I said that almost looks like a meteor strike. Uh, Inferno permission to board the ship. Wait for Leo and I. Oh, yeah, it doesn't work, Leo. We're gonna go. We're gonna enter the breach. What? Oh, the shuttle bay is opened. The shuttle bay is unsealing currently. Let's enter this way. We'll be able to we'll meet up and we'll set up. We'll, we'll, we'll put the plan here. Do not enter the shuttle bay with the craft. We do not know. Date, structural integrity of the vessel. Keep it close. My vessel is parked right nearby the breach. I am entering shuttle bay now. Thank you. That event was pretty messy. Not going to do that again. I don't think it was sealed to the outside uh, elements. This, uh, yeah, this damage is indicative of a meteor strike. A no, big should have held that. Even if the shields had failed, they still would have had phasers. Yeah, it's unlikely that a meteor strike would have done something like this unless 
their shields were down for some reason. But their shields, they, their shields seem like they should be fine. Yeah. Shield registering as on in my, uh, yeah. my Everybody heart, meet me in the yeah. shuttle bay. What was that? Shuttle bay. Alright. Once again, we have we have received no response. So we're gonna take and seeing as this ship has been missing for nearly a decade, we may let's take this care of me. Let's split up in team. You're Leo, you're with me. Ten, three, four, stick together. That's good. Oh, I'm with you then. Uh, yes. uh, you are. You are. That's new. Out. Gentlemen, before we split up, come over here. Take a look at this. What did you see? Yeah, we have that on our end too. This is. This is not. It's a rear turret. That a. Some form of barrier. Yeah, these yeah. were not uh, the, these were not commonplace on the Sovereign class. I know. Granted, I used to command one. Granted, the Sovereign was uh, the Sovereign was the closest thing Starfleet made to a warship for a long time, but they didn't have the ease. Okay, gentlemen, on me. Transport room's clear. The hey, airlock. These three fours. Don't get too far ahead of me. Either side. Either side. Opening the door. Uh, Lieutenant Quarters. Nothing in there. Clear. Clear. Recreation line. Give the side of the door. We'll back up. Clear. Recreation line to clear. Large room here. Back room. Back room. Ten, ten forwards doors are open. And it's got weapons. Okay, we'll stay out of there for now. Lieutenant Ford B, stack up, people. Clear. Here's a better question. Did y'all already sweep the armory? Did y'all sweep the armory? Uh, yes. Armory was in... I'm heading in 10 forward. I did not sweep the armory. I did. Okay. Forward is clear. There's no one behind the bar. Lavatories are clear. <laughs> and far in that. Weapons in here. This is I odd. I don't know. There may be a lot of shit in there. Check for the. Repeat that. Uh, re re repeat that. Three fourths. You said there's no weapons in the armory. Uh, no, I said there was weapons in the ten forward. Oddly enough. Hi. Okay, gentlemen. Hello. <laughs> here's uh, here's something weird. There's no weapons in that. There's no weapons in that armory. Yeah, armory's completely empty. Even I've never emptied my armory. That's saying something. Yeah. Yeah, there's something something odd is going on here. Okay. Let's gentlemen, head. You and me. We're heading up to the bridge. That's what I was just about to suggest. Yeah. Let's see if we well, what about engineering? I'm gonna, that's what I was about to say, I'm, uh, send you and I go down to the engineering bay. Uh, sounds good to me. I'm right behind you. Right, engineering this way. We're gonna clear. Right. Yeah. Hold on, you. We, 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 yeah, we have to go down. Shuttle bay control, you go to cap. You go to cap. Shuttle bay control is clear. There's another one of those defense turrets down here. Cafeteria Cap is clear. Let's. Yeah. Okay. Hey, did Got you a body. Bye. Got... Got a body. Out of where? What do you have on him? Uh, uh he's nothing. Uh, bridge is open. Bridge is open. Bodies. We have bodies. We have bodies. It appears to be commanding officer. This is a command crew. It's three, uh, three dead three bodies. Four. Uh, three we got, we, we got, we got a battle arena down here. Careful. The close pop. that door. No uh, Sen, I need you down here. I'm, right I'm going you. to check the room. I'm we got guns and bodies. Uh, we got red and blue down here. Uh, we have red and yellow. Man, staff, and engineering were down here. Uh, the bodies on the bridge have bullet holes, but there's no weapons on any of them. 
not unreasonable at this point. But think they were ambushed? Raided. These bot, these look strange though. They don't seem particularly old yet. The ship hasn't doesn't show any signs of recent activity. No, all no, these guns are offline. Okay, engineering's clear. I'm gonna help. I want you to help me to the rest of the ship. Yeah, so let's go to the next floor okay. up. Helmet's we gotta up. clear that. We're here. We're already here. Ten four. Okay. Medbay. Med we Back it up. Bodies. Uh, airlock's open. Airlock mid floor is open. The stairwell. Medbay's clear. Mister Three Fourths, did we check all these bodies? I did, yes. There's the body over problem. here near state dining. Stopping back up with you, Inferno. Okay. Prepare to enter state dining room. Now. Meteor storm inbound. Ah, uh, meteor storm. Oh boy. Oh. Okay, the shield oh. dropped the air of it. Cafe's where the damage was. Did I hear an SOS from you, Thunder? Uh, so there was a meteor storm. Coming down to quarters? The, the state dining room is where the damage was. Yeah. We're entering captain's quarters. I right behind you. Oh. Something we're clear. What the hell? We're getting bombarded by meteors. Uh, secondary control is clear. Secondary checking. Control. Checking captain or. This is not captains out, this is shuttle. I'm gonna ca check captains, yeah. Maybe there's something in it that we don't know about yet. What the fuck? Captain's uh, out. The cap uh, this sh shuttle here is full of stuff. I got a data pad. Got a data pad, guns. Uh, data pad is empty. Well. Oh, How many guns are on that Captain in front uh, One. And, and I'm R30E. We got an elite grinder, elite hand drill, elite welder, med kits, power kits, some and some coffee. They were preparing to leave. Yeah, it sounds like somebody was trying to. Uh, indeed, Captain Inferno, please report to the uh, captain's quarters. Hi. I may have found something. Checking that, checking this locker. Everybody else hey, on guard. It looks like it might be sealed with some command codes. I might have to take a moment to deal with it. Give me a moment. Uh, where is Captain's yacht? Dealt with it. Not the yacht. It. Straight, straight forward. I know, I but mean, I was just asking. Just straight. Forward. Oh, this is bad. Let's hear it. This is bad. Section 31. Damn Section 31. I think they sent us out here to die, testing an automated security system without a proper security test. What were they thinking? Engineer is going to try to shut down the warp core and hopefully kill the system causing this. But there's so many security protocols in place. We may have to scuttle the ship. The unwatch of the sovereign class vessel cannot get back to the star base at any cost. Yeah, and all those, every single one of those interior turrets are fully loaded. Oh, shoot! Our turrets just came back online. Oh, shoot! Got you, Thunder. Our okay. our oh no! They can fire. Our shuttles are firing on the vessel. Turn them off. Already on it. Oh god. Oh god. That's what's back here. Shuttle. 
Okay, that's down. Phase cannons are disabled. My turn to get to the higher, the more advanced weapon system. I'll activate it. What the hell? What happened? Uh, I think we won't be able to get out because of the shield, so... The interior turrets seem to be... I am checking the system. The interior turrets are the only thing that seems to be hacked by the space pirates. Okay. Yeah. So our our large ship is firing. I thought I deactivated the weapons on it, but apparently not. So, so the, shield are the shields is, are holding. And the shield is allied, right? Yes. Well, I don't think it matters. They're holding. Well, what I meant is if they're not allied, it may be... Well, we'll have to deal with that when we're done with the ship. We can disable. Uh, let me see if I can't disable those shields. Uh, shield access to uh, yeah, access to not. Uh, give me three minutes. I can get those shields online or offline for us, or keep them online, but they'll be ours. You got two. I'm sorry, I just had to. I took three minutes. You got two. Oof. And front row. Shields are shields are ours. More and more of this ship is getting is transferring over. So there's an artificial intelligence hacking the ship. That might be what the uh, that might be what the captain was talking about in his log. Hidden. This nearly fell on me right here. Talk about the security issues. I don't like this. I was going around, looking around, keeping y'all safe, and uh, then all of a sudden, one of the turrets were shooting at me, and then I fell through the floor. Then all the hell break broke loose. Lucky. Yeah. This Any thing almost fell on me. Did get shot yeah. up a little bit. You're lucky all that you're lucky all it did was fall on you. That's the warp core. It almost hit me. Yeah, a lot of the ship was taken over. The warp core is offline. There's another uh, dead red, and uh, there's a dead blue here. Oh, there's another dead red, and another dead blue. There's nothing on the bodies. I uh, I hear gunshot. Everything okay? I'm clearing a turret. It doesn't have a shot at me, but I have a good shot at it. What uh, the hell? The captain's yacht is disconnected. Gentlemen, I may have to clear these tracks out the fun way. With your, uh... Your definition of fun is sick, twisted, and perverse. <laughs> I know! That's why people like me. You, you, uh. talking, about, you talking about the goods I gave you? Yeah, that one. Yeah. Captain's yacht was also... Clear? Yeah, disconnected. Not only disconnected, I, I have no access to it. It's been it's been tapped by by somebody. Very what? clear. The room is very the uh, ten forward is very very clear. I can assure you. Uh, as in, we don't have a ten forward. It's still there. It's just very clear. Okay. Uh. I hate to say it, but we're gonna have to follow what uh, the captain of this uh, the captain of this ship wanted to. We're gonna have to scuttle this thing. I want to destroy this system before it has a chance. Any chance of doing anything at this point? I don't like it. I had hoped to. Uh, I had hoped to be able to bring it back as a replacement for the last ship we lost. The Resolute, uh, my yeah. own ship. Yeah, we can't. Uh, if this thing is some sort of AI virus, we cannot risk it getting. Can you imagine what this would do if it got to the rest of, or, God it's forbid, or God forbid, star based? I don't want to think about it. 
Yeah. I don't think it's necessarily a virus. There might have already been something planted on the ship to cause it to act in such a way. I'm not seeing any like viruses a, like in the hack, system. Like a hacking I'm think, device? I'm thinking maybe remote access. Concerning. I'm thinking oh. maybe somebody might have remotely activated these because I was I was in the systems. I was looking through the systems when they activated, and so they like, just they all flipped. Like a hacking device. I sounds think we need to break the remote controller. Sounds like Section 31 is after their old tricks. I think we need to find and break the remote controller and get rid of the antenna so they don't have remote access to the ship, and then we could work on it. Handle it. And four. I love how the bastards who did this. I, I don't have my skeleton key with me, otherwise I'd just break it myself, but I didn't bring it. Uh, out of character, I love how... Uh, Section 31 is that group everybody knows about, but they know nothing about it. Uh, keep an eye for... Anybody knows the schematics for this ship? I need to find the remote controller responsible for this. Uh, I, 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 um, I know a few workarounds from when I, when I was in command of the Resolute. It'll take me a few minutes. It would be logical to put it either in engineering or in computer core. Well, I know there's a computer core next to the uh, transporting room. Gentlemen, I'll be on the bridge. I'm gonna do my best to access the systems remotely. I try my best. I haven't Let's been able to get in do. without my skeleton key. Yeah, I used to remember. I used to command one of these ships. If we know a few, we'll see little secrets that they tell us. Fair. Uh, control C is hacked and ready for it. Thank you. I'm heading, I'm heading down into engineering. Uh, did anybody take care of the weapons in engineering? Uh, engineering is clear. Uh, the... Or... Ooh, what's going on? What? I'm taking out interior turrets. I can get it. I can't access much, but I can get a readout. There's only a single interior turret, turret remaining. And four on that. This thing's got boatloads of ammunition. Restock if you need. Might be useful to get a couple of Gatling guns running on our own ship. Or at least it had boatloads of ammunition. Yeah, without going through them, none of them had ammunition. None of the ones I checked, at least. Odd. We have a problem. What is it? They have access to a functioning warp drive. That's what I'm looking. I'm gonna get down into engineering. It'll only. It'll. I doubt it'll really do much, considering well, we're in a gravity field and high and the warp core out. But residual power might allow them to make a single jump if they get us out of this gravity well. I don't. Where is that warp drive? The ship hasn't started moving yet. Uh, I did grind the part. I did uh work on salvage operations on a on a uh, sovereign. Oh, this. Uh, I'm grinding up a bomb. Warheads. Full of it. Uh, there wasn't really much time to think about it because I didn't know it was a bomb until I was already cutting through it. So they're... They may, they may seem like bombs, but really they're just high-capacity power. Okay. No, they are quite volatile, I'll admit. We got some programmable blocks down here. I'm going to disable them. Who's one to jump drive is somewhere near the sides of engineering? Guys... Yes. Yeah. Don't look now, but I think we just lost the captain's yacht. What happened to it? Uh, it is currently shooting off roughly, uh, what do you mean roughly off? the direction of the roughly the direction of the sun at uh, 
nearly full impulse. I don't see it. one. One. It. One. This sun is moving pr very fast, and two. I don't see a signal for the shuttle. Everyone can repair it to the shuttle. Captain's the ship. Yeah, the I don't ship. see a signal for the captain's yacht. Everyone can repair it to the shuttle. I saw it visually. I saw it visually fly away. I thought I disabled the captain's yacht. I pulled it off and started grinding some of it up. Uh, we're dealing with a potentially we're dealing with a potential computer virus or AI or whatever here. And now it has its own vessel. I will say that there's so not much left of that vessel. I want to make sure something like this didn't happen. Apparently, I didn't do a good enough job. That sun is moving very fast. Where where are these FTL drives located? I don't remember. Oh. Okay, I disabled the large reactors. I'll disable them the I'll disable them the nice way. The ship won't be seeing uh, uh pretty much right here. Uh, What's happening? What's happening? Uh, uh, getting to the jump drives. Yeah. Also, that is what I meant when I said I found a way to rapid fire. <laughs> about where you are on this side as well. Drives are down. Jump drives down. Ten four. I'm getting the ones over here. I don't have the patience to it. Drive disabled. Ooh, you got a oh, well. I found one. <laughs> you know, I found. I think I just realized an easier way of doing this. Disconnect the missile. Three fourths. Turn around. Yeah. What is it? That. Uh, excuse me? Away. Sir? Sir? Hmm? Yes? What's wrong? No, 3 Force likes to talk to, uh, 3 Force likes to talk to machinery. Uh, uh, why was the ship moving? Once again, it launched itself. As a remote controller, I... I actually grinded the seat off this one earlier. I mean, I'm about to I'm about to permanently remove this ship nacelle. There's so many places you can hide a remote controller from me. This is Starfleet actual. Please report your situation over. Brace. Oh shoot. This is Star uh, this, uh, this is this is This is Starfleet actual trying to reach Commander Sen, anyone there? Commander Sen, here, go with Heavy Admiral. The, well, I'm, I'm, I'm actually trying to be the Starfleet, actually, not the Admiral. Right. Go ahead, uh, actually. Uh, Captain Inferno, you should be the one to uh, respond to this. Oh, Captain Inferno is there. I'm actually Admiral through the line. Catch Inferno you here. Inferno. Wait, you're there? What are you doing there? Hi. Wait. Deep fire. What, what's oh, happening? What's this happening? Is not a good time for subspace communications. What do you mean? What's happening? We've you guys discovered need... um, the Odyssey. The Odyssey. And what's the sign of the Odyssey? That shit's they... been missing for years. <sighs> well, it got hacked and it's falling towards the planet. Hmm. From what, I can, from what we yeah. found out, and I'll, bring, I'll write a proper report later. Section 31 had a hand in... Section 31? Yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll dabble with them soon. I know a few people who could handle this. Only six people. Top it's... classification after this, I can't tell you much more. Only oh. Inferno. Inferno, I think you know exactly what I mean when I say six people. Not a, not a damn clue, sir. Not a damn clue. Don't say this out loud. These are clearance codes. 
get SSS on it. Oh. Huh. On section 31, of course. No, I was saying aw, because I was asking Sen if this, uh, if the world had deadly reentry, so that the ship would burn up. Okay, well, I keep, keep, uh, can't wait to read that report. You guys have good luck chasing that ship. Also, did he find any of the old captain any life signs on board, or even bodies? Uh, there were bodies, definitely. Lots bodies, of bodies. Okay. Lots and we of found a report. It appears that, well, Second 31 gave them an automated defense system, but did not give them a proper security staff, and may have left them to die. Copy. They were sent on an... Well, it seems they might have been sent on a suicide mission. Can't wait to read that report. Good luck. Everybody, head Starfleet, back to ship. Starfleet actual out. Yeah. Everyone, let's head back to our Actually, ship. Actually, I should say Star Prime out. Yeah. The ship's, um... The well, ship's say it'll gone. Now the ship's in the gravity well. It's not going to survive that impact. Exactly. Uh, I have no sh no sign of Arth shuttles. I put it in the GPS. Okay. I'm gonna need you to resend those cords. I'm on my way. I tried my best to try to save the ship, but there wasn't enough power to even power any other thrusters. It was done. We didn't want to save the ship. I thought we wanted to figure out what was going on. We want, no, we wanted to make sure it was never seen again. It's a shame. I can disagree, but I would like to study that to figure out what caused it so we could figure out a way to stop it from ever happening again. Could place so a GPS... Could place a GPS for further analysis. Could have possibly ran through and reverse engineered some of the some of the code. Might have been able to find out who made it. Uh, Section so thirty one. Yeah. Kind oh, of you already got that. Secret. That's about as much as we're gonna get. Trust me. Yeah. And for clandestine secret organization within Oh, this is Nobody wants to ride with me? <laughs> I will ride with you. <laughs> I'm just waiting for y'all to pick a ship to go into. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get back in. Oh, whoa. Now. I think uh, deadly reentry, I think, activated or something big just spawned in. No, I think that was the. Uh, I think that was the impact of the. Uh, Shit with the planet. Oh, of the boy. on a hard pan surface. Ooh, just imagine. Go down there. Let's go down there and make sure. I'll follow right can behind these, you. Can these vehicles sustain and re-entry? Yes, they can. Of course, we also have to see if we even land close to it. It'll be pretty easy. You know the general area. Breaking character for a moment. You guys having fun? Definitely. Yeah. Hell yeah. Great. <laughs> it's nice and short too. Yeah, it's hard to make these really. It's hard to make these self-contained. Yeah. It was nice to have something just nice and short that's not like gonna be like, oh, here we are for another ten years. <laughs> <laughs> All right. See everybody in two weeks for the next section. <laughs> well, D and D, it's like every week. Yeah, some I don't people have... it's every week. Some people it's every two weeks, depending on their schedule. I don't have the time to run a, a, a. I don't have the. I don't have the time to come up with a mission like this every week. <laughs> but I figured, you know. And again, this is out of character. Real credit to uh, Inferno and. Uh, Leo here, as soon as they caught wind that I was doing something, they were like, I want in. 
<laughs> it's it's mainly because I kind of just watch everybody on my Steam. Because <laughs> yeah. on Discord you don't have any status, huh? so it's just I only see pop on Space Engineers on Steam. Yeah. Julio, if you'll please, please close your eyes and bring us towards the. Oh, I see wreckage. Uh, I see the wreckage. I thought I saw wreckage. Yeah, I definitely yeah. see wreckage. Bring us down. There it is. It's starting to load in. Oh, there's one. Once we're down there, if any computer systems have survived, we're gonna we're gonna wipe them off the face of the planet. I, I mean, not just wipe the computers. Oops, tired. Or, you know, just put all these bad boys on. In fact, I'm going to do that right now. Full stop. Whoop, 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 whoop. I have no idea where the main thrust on this is. Uh. Meteor I was about to say, Ensign, throw us, uh, slow us down a little bit more. Oh, yep, I slowed down. Where those thrusters come from? I want you to Hello? grind down any terminal blocks you may find. Where those thrusters come from? Anybody? Where hmm? those thrusters come from? All along the saucer and starboard side? Uh. I am uncertain of what you speak, and uh, Ensign Thunder and I are still on the proxy touchdown. And we have touchdown. I don't know. Okay, that was weird. Uh, my mic put its volume all the way down to nothing. Uh, I was saying that was me in my last ditch effort trying to save the ship. What? Last ditch effort to try to save the ship. I mean. Self-explanatory. But we just clarified that this thing has a virus on it, so we want to put it down. Right. Yeah, but I wanted to study it, and that was before those orders were placed. Uh, I saw it start to speed up and leave, so I'm like, oh, shoot. Where did that timer block come from? Did you just place that? I'm placing it and rigging the ship for detonation. Ah. Uh. About that, I just realized something. It did not play. But yeah. Take down any anything that could be used to access ship systems. Besides, that's not like doors. Uh. Based on what three four says, it sounds like he's rigging up the ship for self destruct. 10 4 on that. <laughs> I like because I like big explosions. What can I say? Well, I like big dicks, but I'm here, aren't I? I, like I mean, but I cannot lie. <laughs> Computer core is completely intact. You're talking about the three things next to transporter room? The three yep. programmable blocks? Well, we're at it. Let's rip out these transporters. Uh, I don't think we're gonna have to worry too much about that. I've uh, oh okay. Um. Oh, Mister Three Fourths, I. What? Never mind. Never mind. As you were. Carry on. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what are you doing? My job. Gentlemen, I'm going to steal the captain's chair. That would be a good ornament. Put yeah. it in a museum. I don't think using it on my next ship. Just remember, everybody, just remember. 
if you see a bomb technician running, follow him. <laughs> <laughs> You've been demoted. To what? Bomb technician? That's a demotion? But if you ever so see a bomb waste disposal, you know, I was I would just waste disposal. I know, you're safe. Oh, you no, 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 no. Uh, uh, bomb, te bomb technician is an upgrade from waste disposal. It's the same thing, it's just a <laughs> better the path. It's the same thing, just better. Yeah. There's a credit That's how that works. These, uh, credit to the design of these Sovereign class vessels, though. Main hull is fairly intact. Hi there. I know, I know. <laughs> Hello there. Hello so there. Uh, I think those engines you placed down uh, three fourths did more than you expected. Yeah. I'm gonna strip down part of engineering. There's something is on this ship that should never see the light of day. Do we need to worry about them themselves, or are those fine? You know what? I want them to blow too. Uh, we're, I like it when things there, blow. There are lightning storms. I just saw that. Oh boy. I guess all the all the dust and sand on this planet is starting to interact. Oh, that was right next to me. <laughs> I'm gonna shut down impulse engines. That's not shutting down! Why did you turn it back on, Leo? Uh, Thank you. There's bombs on that ship! Uh, cheating the nacelles, not the ship. I know, there's bombs on them! <laughs> well, we're at it. Let's take down the ship. Oh, the lightning ship. struck the ship! Yeah, Let's uh, take down the shields. Aware, that the, the shields are ours. I've, I've claimed them and hacked them. We're not going to be using them much longer, considering that we're about to blow this ship sky high. Fair. When I see, when I, uh, just to clarify, gentlemen, when I want something ground down, I mean, I want it gone. He is the, he is the acting captain. Actually, he's not even. Apologies, you're not acting. You are captain. That is correct. But I don't mind. <laughs> I may sound great with the. Uh, I may sound great with protocol, but I am known to slip up from time to. Time we all do it. Do be careful, guys. Uh, that lightning is extremely close to us. Yeah, not only is there a lot of lightning, but we got we got a sandstorm. Well, I'm gonna the light. The light mission is... the ship's weapon ray. The lightning is caused by the friction from all the dust. That's what the sandstorm is. Okay. Yeah. Lightning is uh, the same. Ship is rigged for detonation. Okay, gentlemen, get to over about. Get in the ship. Um, we need to set the timers for the warhead. I'm, wor I'm working on it. Get to your ships. I will get the warhead started. Oh. Ooh, that poor gyroscope over there it keeps getting struck. And I'm detonation, right detonation time will be one minute. Yeah. Confirm. Everybody? We got everybody? Uh, no, we don't have three fourths in the ship. We don't have three fourths in the vessel, uh, Ensign. I've got three fourths, you go. Okay. So just me, and... okay. I will get in the co pilot. Count there. Countdown is being started. Uh, three fourths. I've got, I got three of these I gotta work, I gotta do. Uh, then shouldn't you set them at different speeds? At yeah. Two. Uh, full stop, Ensign. I want. We want to make sure this thing goes off. We don't want to leave the rest of the crew behind. Yep. Big boss. If anything survives, you can blow it up later. Until then, I'm giving you an order. Get to the shuttle. Three. Four. Three. I would agree. Don't worry about it. Uh, You'd rather it keep you alive. I'm, I'm getting in with Inferno. Went in with the Let's go. Now. 
I'm with Inferno. Okay, you guys get I out I see of you guys moving. Uh, detonation in 15 seconds. Oh, oh less than 15 seconds. <laughs> is, there, how many, is there any more? Is there there are two more explosives. That's the second one. Should be one more set of explosions. Stay back, Mr. Leo. Uh, if we fly up to 2.5 kilometers, we'll be above the dust storm. Okay. okay. I'm gonna have to go back. I'm gonna go back down there and personally make sure everything's gone. Yeah, that's what oh. there's, there's the last one. That's that should the be the last one. one. Oh, that was the second? Okay. We have one more we gotta wait for. With regards to altitude, gentlemen, be advised minimum safe distance is about one kilometer on this planet. There's the last one. The last explosion. Okay. I saw impulse engines, but I didn't see much else. There's nothing anyone can salvage from that. Okay, uh, let's go through this. Yep. Ain't much left of the ship. If you find a battery, take it out. Got yeah, some on the. Out. We got some artificial mass on the nacelles, but. Like I said, I don't see anything powered. No. There's a jump drive on here that we forgot to remove. <laughs> Grind it up. Don't forget, you, don't forget you guys have headlights. They don't work that well in the sandstorm. It still works better than nothing. <laughs> the main my ship... In front of my damn face. Got some uranium down here. Might be able to salvage it if we need, but... I would say that is a proper execution of a ship. Holy crap, that worked a lot better than I thought it would. Yeah, you got most of it. I do like my explosions. Most of it. <laughs> hey, people. Oh! This got struck by lightning! You okay? You okay? Yeah, I'm good, but my suit did its job. Good. Yeah, I advise you guys get out of there, break for orbit. There uh, is one I piece. am. Yep, we're good. I'm heading towards Starfleet as, at the moment. Up to the ship. That we don't. That's a. Uh, oh, never mind. That was uh, for you guys, because uh, you guys were falling okay, into the planet. Alright, coming over. Just oh, follow. Uh, just follow. Alright, let's get out of here. We'll need yep. to get an official crew to get rid of everything else. Yeah. Life may evolve on no. this. We don't want them. <laughs> There's still warheads. <laughs> Apparently one of my warheads didn't count down, I just watched the rest of the ship explode. That uh, was lightning. No! That was a lot bigger than lightning! No, 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 Six Force. That was lightning. Ah, gotcha. Lightning. Uh, I have no idea where the ship is, but I am going back to the parasiting. Just follow, uh, where... If you see my beacon. I am to your uh, to Leo Draconis one. It's not too far from my uh, ships. I deleted my Leo Draconis one. <laughs> I'm turning I'll up send it back our to... broadcasting. I'm turning up our broadcasting. Just so we can on. Well, you're 12 clicks above us. Oh. Yeah, there was nothing left of that ship to be salvaged. That's for sure. This is what we needed. It's always a shame to see a sovereign go down like that. Meteor storm inbound. Oh, great! The meteor storm. Ensign, prepare for evasive maneuvers. Ensign, prepare, prepare your will. Make sure you have it written out. <laughs> oh, we did that. You can go ahead and stop now because that's that we just passed our uh, our yep registered cargo vessel. Thunder Fox. I just noticed that your name was Fox and not Emoji. Yes. Oh! That meteor was close. I'm still seeing some lightning effects from the planet. Maybe it's an ion storm as well? It's possible. 
I'm seeing lightning in the atmosphere, like way up here, yeah. or out of the atmosphere. It's got to be something like that. Maybe it's maybe it's just a combination of an ion storm and the sandstorm. It's possible. <laughs> Is anybody here a Terran? A what? Terran. Matter of fact, I am. Yes, I I am. Uh, uh, no, I was just saying, because Ion Storm. A Terran? Uh, a lot of times, it's, uh, when there's an Ion Storm, someone from the Mirror Universe could transfer over. Why did it... Okay, Kim. Oh, uh, I thought you meant Terran as raised on Earth. No, I meant as in Terran Empire. Oh, then absolutely not. Oh, uh, yeah, still yes. Why do you think I get away with so many war crimes? I have asked myself that question many times. Well, the answer is they know they can't stop me, and it's better that I follow at least some regulations than be a free agent. It's ba you're basically the same as Empress Jojo from Discovery. I'm Empress Jojo, but Empress Jojo's, you know. Well, let's just put it this way she has a much shorter record than I do. Criminal record, yeah. that is. And yet, you've become a Starfleet captain. <laughs> What's your point? Alright. Here you go. Almost there, move a bit forward. There you go. There you go. Thrusters are down and we are locked. Ten four. All right, let's take this cargo ship back to uh, Starfleet Outpost. We got it from. Since when do we have an interior turret? Now I'm concerned. Uh, it's. We've had that for a while. Yeah. We won't have that much longer. <laughs> yeah, a lot of Every... <laughs> hey, 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 hey. There are gentler ways to oh, take no. care of things. Uh oh. We are trying to fly this thing. It would be nice if you didn't put a hole in it. It will fly just fine. <laughs> hey ho, to the bottle I go. That doesn't mean we'll breathe just fine. To heal my heart and drown my woe. Hello. Hello. Does anybody, a question, um, send, does this ship, um, who owns this ship? Uh, it's an unlicensed cargo, uh, an unlicensed cargo shipping company. Nice. So they yeah. won't mind if I put a dent in their hull, will they? In their deck plating? Well, it's not... Dark it's not problem, ours, which so means I don't break it. Then you not do that. This is not ours. Don't break okay. it. Oh. Remember, uh, remember, Captain, you guys are the, uh, uh I, you may be the ranking officer, but I was the one who was greenlit for this mission, so if anything goes south, it's my neck, it, it, it's my neck I, that, that's on the line here. You think that's a fair enough compromise there, having it dealt with like that? Uh, where is the... Stand by. Three forces in his little hidey hole. <laughs> you ready to go? Yeah, I got a turn. Oh, whoa. Did we just teleport back to base? I oh. So... Warp travel was successful. It's pirate sighting. Oh, 
we'll have to warp to planet Earth or wherever our main base is. Uh, we... That was, uh, fully successful. That was more like a wormhole. Well, well let's put it this way. We got where we needed to go. Yeah. And I think they'll appreciate the um, additions I made to their ship, don't you? What's going on down here? Uh, roleplay. Okay. We are just about to wrap up the uh, uh, this particular mission. I am sorry. Dear God, what happened to the station? Uh, what do you mean, what happened to the station? I mean... Did... Oh, meteors. This thing has no automated defenses. It does have shields, though. But are they still meteors? It might have been as I, uh, it, it might have happened before I, uh, uh, put the shields on as I was getting everything set up. This wasn't like this when we left. Yeah, I'm thinking, I, it might be your shields didn't stop it. Hmm. Possible. Well, breaking character, mission accomplished. Yeah. This was way bigger and more awesome than I expected it to be. I <laughs> was going to do this as a, as a little, you know, a little shooting mission with uh, three fourths and, uh, and and thunder, and you guys. It literally is a case of the more the merrier. Yeah. Yeah. If I'm around, I'm almost always down for this kind of thing. I will continue to bounce ideas off uh, um, Star Prime for stuff that I can do. Next few are probably to be uh, next few are probably going to be uh, simulation style missions. But uh, yeah, RP is RP. Yeah. I mean, he, if he knows in advance that uh, um more than, than that, like you guys are involved too he might give me clearance to do something a bit more in depth yeah that'd be a yeah that'd work so gravity is a bit wonky but okay well that would be because we have two different uh, we have two different grids competing for gravitational dominance <laughs> Good, uh... Uh, give it over a bit. Yeah, Maybe. whenever I make a ship, I always try to make sure that the gravity field is tightly fit to the ship. That way this doesn't happen. Meteor storm inbound. Admittedly, yep. I didn't make the ship. I literally was just, oh crap, we don't have small ship jump drives. Copy paste. Yeah. Yep. So, so which, let me, uh. Oh, I forgot about those. I never actually got to properly test yeah. those. Yeah. Pretty cool. Give me a second. Uh, is the role play over? Yeah, we're basically, we're basically done with this. Okay. I want to show you guys this ship that I have. No, wait. It's got a remote controller, and for some reason, it's spawning in and going off to fight things. Hi ho! Hi <laughs> ho! Hi ho! We're all going to hell. Why does my ship just? Oh wait! It's target. Your missiles are targeting meteors. I think I think clang's happening on my ship, and it's just freaking out. <laughs> uh, there are certain mods not on my ship anymore, so it's freaking out. That's why I don't use mods. If you make something without I don't play vanilla servers. <laughs> like if you make something without modifications, then you can be used universally. That's true, yeah, but... but it's a whole lot less fun. Indeed. That that's why you take that's why you make something universal, then you just modify it for whatever scenario in. This one here is my typhoon, but I remember.
remember this. Uh, it lost its gyros because I still had old gyros on it. Oops. Um. Why are the black cannons shooting up the Type 11? I have oh, no so idea. No, because someone is manually controlling them, that's why. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. You know those cannons are wider than the character, right? The only time you ever hit me is because of how much they spread. <laughs> you guys all had fun with this? Yeah. Indeed. Yeah. Yeah, this is, uh... This is my little ship, the Typhoon. I was talking about are like, Yeet. 30 of them. That is left that's a lot of hurt. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's mainly, it's not meant for space travel, but it's capable. It's definitely an atmospheric strike ship. But it is capable of space flight. Not the best, but it is capable. I've been hijacked. <laughs> I mean, now we're just, now we're just that time and kind of... <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know. Yeah, but I've gonna, still been hijacked. <laughs> don't worry, I'll save you. I, I don't know how how well saving will be done, but saving will be done <laughs> Yeah, I'm definitely gonna recommend you rethink your uh, position from Chief Engineer to TACCOM for reports. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> Explosions too much. Tee -hee. <sighs> I'm turning off my antenna so they can't see me coming. Yeah. And, uh, when I see my friend coming. Well, final last bit of uh, role play, uh, Ensign Thunder. Well done on your uh, your first real store tee. Thank yous. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good, oh. good <laughs> Tried so hard, but come so far. I tried. Up, oh, I don't know where the base went. Base disappeared. Stand by, coordinates incoming. It just disappeared out of nowhere. What's going on? Because <laughs> I turned off my antenna. Probably. Hello. 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 Ah, wow, wow. <laughs> Say hello to my little friend. Say hello uh, to my little friend. Say hello to my little friend. Who is who has just joined us? Mm -hmm. Cat keeper. Cat keeper. Nice. keeper of cats. Cat I'm keeper. Keeper of. Well, uh, I hate to say it, but you did sort of, uh, I, I didn't even know you were a person on this server. I just, I put a, I put together a little, uh, roleplay mission for, uh, Three Fourths and Thunder here, and Inferno and Leo decided to, uh, jump in, and, uh, that has ultimately just expired, so we're just kind of messing around right now. You are welcome to do so, but... The actual story stuff is over. I really need to get to bed. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, you stayed on like uh, almost. You stayed on almost an hour longer than you planned. Which Hi. speaks to uh, my storytelling. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Bye. This okay. ship is really not meant for space travel.
The ship is literally just meant for atmospheric travel and possibly um, upper atmospheric travel, but definitely not space flight. <laughs> it's got like four, it's got eight ion thrusters for going forward, two for going down, two for going up, two for going backwards, and one on each side. And it's full of heavy armor, so <laughs> the can you know the inertial energies are just insane. Right. Unfortunately, I also have to take off. That means I'm gonna have to shut down the server. I should be back in roughly an hour. Okay. Uh, I gotta do some. I gotta do a quick errand for my buddy Greg. So, gentlemen, as always, honor and a privilege. Three fourths thunder. I'll probably catch you guys in about sixty minutes. Okay. Ten four. All right. Take care, everyone. All right. Bye-bye. Have bye. a good one. Okay. Bye. Join him in disappearing from the time stream. <laughs> yep, yep. Basically. All right. <laughs> yep. Yeah, that was good. That was good, that was that good was though. Fun. That was very good. It was a blast. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta go get some sleep because I gotta get up early tomorrow. Ew, fun. Yeah. <laughs> I might just hop I... back on to VR. It's nice meeting you. Well... Good night. <laughs> All right. Oh man, I was going through uh, my mom's pictures on Facebook, trying to find that picture of me with the sword, and I found uh, one of my Halloween costumes a few years ago. Oh, nice. I went as uh, um, uh, I think it might have been Marine. Hmm. Um. Uh, but a few of my friends are in the military, and I was never able to because, you know, I'm kind of fat and have medical problems. Yeah. I used to want to, though. Nothing wrong with that, man. And then my sister was... I, I don't know what she exactly went. Might have just been a princess, as most, you know, young kids do. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna end the stream at this moment. Thank you Go for forward. watching for whoever I watched. Bitch. It's Ow. actually to it's actually YouTube. Bye YouTube. <laughs> Screams. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs>